And here they come, the audience is lit, is excited, trying to support him in, in his third fight today. Oh, interesting situation in Nevaza. Soinagi, uh, Lukas swept over, slipped over the dishes back, but the turning in the upper body was was no good. So Lukas missed this out without no score change. Now here starts. He's a. F I shouldn't. Thought earlier. He's a type of fighter. And he will. He will show it, I think, in a minute that he can fight. Though it, it doesn't seem so. In this previous minute. He's grabbed his. He has grabbed his favorite grab, left hand. At the neck. Now he's making problems to the chef. Oh. past the neck and <laughs> now you can see the chef knows what's what's gonna happen in the nevaza he tried to escape the situation by getting out of the mat Lukas was not fast enough to get into the position and turn him over we are right now in a half of a match A nice Uchigari attempt from one-sided grip and ending up in and out. A very nice throw on man number two right now. The audience is clapping to Kanja Shvili from Georgia. Oh, nice. Oh, wonderful. It's a shame that it hasn't ended by a throw for Lukas. But a very strong. Also to a very Goshi situation. First warning for Dishev of Bulgaria. We switch now to the 
And again, he's, he's down his boat. And Lukash is doing. And drops Soinagi. Drops Soinagi that was out of the position and could not endanger Lukash. And here comes second warning. And Lukash Kerpalak now leading by Yuko. Oh, very nice and very quick. Wrong drop Soinagi that ended up in a Jimmy Vaza and Ippon for Lukas Kerpalek so that he is in quarter final. His next opponent will be the winner of the next match. And the next match is between the Spain Oradis of Cuba and Minas King Grigori of Estonia. Very nice show today of Lukas Kripalek. Three neatly done matches and all ended up with an Ippon before the bell rang. And, and right now it's sure that Lukas